Welcome everyone to Houston News. Today is June June eighth, two thousand and nineteen. Give you all the news according to the charts versus what the articles are reading. We're here to make sure that the things that we are noticing on the internet, whether it's articles or videos, that is also pertaining and being seen on the price chart. Okay, so thank you all for coming and watching our video for today. Uh, definitely going to talk about Litecoin and the halving that is coming in like the next sixty days, sometime in August is when Litecoin having is supposed to occur and as always a lot of people try to display the notion that when that occurs the market should shoot higher in price so we're going to look at this article to see if the price chart is going to continue to show us if Litecoin has the ability to hit two hundred dollars within the next sixty days okay so this article was posted a day ago by Martin Young and he asked us the question Litecoin surges as half in nears. Can it hit $200 in 60 days? Okay, and here's this section right here that tries to go into some of the positive things that Litecoin has been doing in terms of price movement since then and has been moving to the upside. A uh, pretty good clip, but now the question is can it hit $200 by August? Okay, now in the past few hours. Litecoin has started to move upwards again. It's recovered almost all of its losses over the past week, whereas Bitcoin is down 7% right now. Now, there's a crypto trader, go by the name of Crypto Fibonacci. He's been analyzing Litecoin over the last couple of days, two weeks, two months. I'm not exactly sure how long he's been covering this cryptocurrency, but in this Twitter handle right here, he stated last night that I like the price action. I still like it. Expected another retest of $122 to $124 very soon. And you go ahead and click on that particular tweet. And here it is right here. And I want to ask you all the question. This is confusing. It has so many things going on on this price chart that no one would have the understanding as to what direction the market for Litecoin is going to go. He has multiple moving averages. He has volume. He has more indicators down here at the bottom of his chart. And then he has the Fibonacci retracement levels up here at the top portion. And then he still keeps resistance areas in the market for Litecoin. Now the question that we want to pose to you is using all of these indicators, what direction do you think the market is going to go? Precisely, it's too many things going on in the market on this particular chart to determine what is the likelihood of Litecoin moving higher or lower. That's one of the main reasons why we try to pinpoint and show you all that it doesn't require all of that in order to make the market move or participate. I'm sorry, or anticipate what direction the market's going to go. Okay, so. That's why we're here to give you all very clean charts and our price movement analysis is very simple to understand. And we also show you through our price target what we expect the market to do before it actually does it. So now, the statement that follows this tweet, the support zone can be clearly seen at the moving averages. That's why I showed you this. At what moving average are they looking at to distinguish support? And then that still doesn't tell you precisely what's going to happen in the future. Okay. So there is little doubt that the Litecoin halving, which is only 60 days away, is driving the momentum. After the halving for Litecoin, the block reward is going to go from 25 to 12.5. This has the perceived effect of decreasing the supply while increasing the difficulty to mine new coins. It shouldn't have a perceived effect on decreasing the supply because the supply is still out in the market. It's just going to take a little bit more difficulty to mine new coin. That is what the halving is about. It's not about the decreasing of the supply because the supply is still out in the market okay so that continues to show you that 
that should not be the case. Halving has been written into the code and control inflation and prolonged network long longevity. All right. So having events always have a bullish run up and we're going to look at that on the daily price chart to show you that Litecoin has precisely been doing just that. It has been in a movement of higher prices. $200 by August. So far this year, Litecoin has outperformed the majority of its brethren, surging 275% from $30 on January 1st. There's a strong possibility, this author writes, that Litecoin could reach $200 by the halving date of August 6th. So there you go. We know that the halving is going to occur on August 6th for Litecoin. We're going to go ahead and pay attention to the price chart to see if it will in fact make a huge impact as to seeing the continuation of movement higher for Litecoin. One of the last thing he mentions in this article is that the next 60 days are going to see a lot of action talking about price action on the Litecoin price charts. So there. He gives you a lot of hypotheticals. He gives you one instance to where one chartist is looking at Litecoin continuing to move higher. But he really did not give a lot of convincing evidence that it will continue to move higher. So it's going to be our job to look at the price chart for you to see if Litecoin will continue to move to the upside and increase the prospects of it trying to hit $200 by August. So let's go ahead and do that right now. Now, the last time we did our video for Litecoin was on June 3rd. 2019 in which we created this price target and we anticipated Litecoin to move to the downside as you all can tell we achieved that objective once again <clears throat> that would have given us 9.79 percent movement to the downside okay and after we concluded from our video on the 3rd of June the next following day was when Litecoin came and touched our price target objective so now, since that has been reached and achieved, let's go ahead and get rid of it. And now let's make it a cleaner looking chart versus what Crypto Fibonacci is utilizing. Very obvious. The market in Litecoin is in a very bullish up move. Started right here on February 8, 2019. From there, all the way until today's current price. Okay, let's see how much of an increase or bullishness this cryptocurrency has been in so we're going to take it from the close of February 8th and we're going to bring it all the way up here to where we are right now in the market for Litecoin on the close 162 percent the market in Litecoin has made in profit if you were in the market in the foot with this coin on February 8th 2019 162 percent now by August 6th can Litecoin come all the way up here to $200? That's an increase of 355%. Almost half of where we are right now. In the next 60 days. It took Litecoin about 90 days in order for it to get from where we were on August, I'm, I'm sorry, February 8, 2019 to today's date. Today, right now, the market, as you can tell, is getting hit with some weakness. It continues to reflect that a resistance point is at $120, $122, give or take, in the market in Litecoin. But of a positive note is that you guys can see right here. To where we clip this re uh, resistance area in the market in Litecoin and it's actually broken out of this triangle that is formulating on our price chart. So that's positive. And it, when Litecoin broke above this resistance line here on the 6th and the 7th of June, that's a positive as well. The current movement, though, is one of lower prices. I'm not saying that it's going to make a dramatic movement lower. Not yet. Because of those two things that I've just mentioned by breaking out of this triangle 
and as well as breaking out of this ascending line and holding support yesterday tells us that there's still some momentum to higher prices in Litecoin. Three hour chart in the market in Litecoin, you can tell that the weakness is coming in still. Now, I'm telling you now, the market in Litecoin cannot break below $112 or even $110. Okay, that's the support area in the market for Litecoin going forward in order for us to see a continuation of moving higher price. When I look at it on the four hour chart, you can still tell that this coin is still getting hit with some weakness, but it's not it's being maintained. The market is telling us that weakness is present, but we're willing to accept it. We're not trying to allow Litecoin to fall back down in between this triangle on our chart. OK, the market is not trying to allow that to happen. So we're definitely are still seeing indications of this coin strong. But remember, 112, 110 cannot be broken to the downside anymore. If that occurs throughout today, going all the way into August 6th of the halving, then the market has already made its bullish news, its bullish movement regarding that halving event. Okay, because understand the anticipation of the halving started back in February. So 162% movement since then to today's date is a pretty good bullish move. Can it continue? We have to wait and see if the market is going to be able to give us a massive increase in volume as well as its ability to break $122, $122. Now, I am anticipating it to try to continue to move higher, but not $200. Okay, at least maybe $130 to $140 is what we're looking for the market in Litecoin to come in touch in the long term throughout today, going all up there to the month of August. Okay, so. Yes, we're holding some consolidation of trading now. I'm looking for support to be around 110, 112, and then the continuation of movement higher. Our price objective will be uh, around, I said 130 to 140. Let's go ahead and put that in now. And. I'm going to hold it at 130 for the time being. And we're going to bring our price target loss area to around like 110. Okay. So this is it. This is what we're looking for in the market in Litecoin to do over the next couple of days to the month or so. We're going to utilize this. You guys can already tell our prediction of what we want Litecoin to do. $200? I don't know. But we'll see. <clears throat> give us your thoughts. Give us your opinion. And make sure you guys go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Like and share these videos. Because like I said. We're giving you all the news according to the charts. Relatively easy to see and understand. And then on top of that. We're giving you our expectations of the market before it actually happens. Make sure you all maintain your profitability. And don't forget to check us out at our website. HughFinancial.com Enjoy your day. Maintain your profitability and make sure you leave us a comment as to whether or not you think Litecoin is going to hit $200 in the next 60 days.